Hey guys, it's CSFan001 here, welcoming you to the road to the Ben 10 Omniverse 2 Platinum Trophy. So, this is actually my 45th Platinum Trophy, which is pretty cool. 45, only 5 more, and I'll be at 50, and I'm also only a little over 100 trophies away, I believe, from reaching 3,000, so, pretty cool. I haven't even gotten onto the PS4 yet. I also don't use a Move, or a Vita. Or the sound shapes duplication thing. Anyway, uh, so this game, it's another sort of typical kids game. It's not really too difficult, but this one does have some parts of it that can be extremely aggravating. Not even like luck based, but just the game itself is really poorly made and really poorly put together. And there are a few trophies in this game that can be a painful, can be very painful to get. Mainly like. Just because of some of the enemies in the game, because there's these really, really overpowered guys that can, like, freeze you and make you susceptible to everyone's attacks. Until you get this guy that I'm bouncing around as right now. I don't know anything about, like, the Ben 10 series, so I don't really know what to say anything about that. This is the arena mode. You have to get some uh, arena stuff done, but it's a pretty easy platinum trophy still. Not necessarily the easiest, like, kids game platinum. But it's pretty easy, so I would definitely still say pick it up if you want. Can't we all just get along? And Platinum. Wow, now that's pretty lazy. It doesn't even have, like, a better name for it. That's actually kind of funny. Oh, crap, my controller battery's dying. No. I will get it fixed. Well, the heck am I saying? You don't fix a dead controller. Uh, okay, so... I just need to sign in. Sync those trophies on up. And now I can look at the list. But yeah, it's another fairly easy kids game. I would say definitely go for it because it's still pretty easy. Like I said, not necessarily the easiest, but still pretty easy. So definitely worth uh, going for. It's also really fast too. like. It's definitely one of the faster of the sort of kids' Platinums, even if it is a little more challenging at times, so that's another good thing about it. So, let's see it. Ben 10 Omniverse 2, 100% trophies. Oh yeah, I'm up to 16% Borderlands 2, cool. So, like, it's actually, what's crazy about it is it's like, it's a mix of combat and temple run, which isn't really a good combination. Like, this one you'll get along the way, but then these are just, like, things you have to do with the different types of aliens. The big, like, heavy aliens, the small aliens, and the medium aliens. And that's a small alien one, and that one's, like, story-based. And that one you have to grind for. You have to collect a hundred of those uh, energy containers, the ones you have to shoot out of the air. Uh, these are all story-based. And it's a pretty easy game, though, like I said, especially once you get, uh, there's a guy that's invincible to freezing that's really good, and, uh, Cannonbolt, which is the guy that I was using. So then, these are all the collectible-based ones, because there's quite a few collectible tokens, but it's really not too bad to find them. I mean, I had a guide for it, but I probably didn't really even need the guide, because most of them are either pretty close to the main path or pretty easy to find anyway. And then these are just some of the different enemy types. You just have to kill at least 25 of each. And once you do the arena challenges, you'll get them all, no problem. Which is nice. And that's story-based. And that's what I finished up right there, was completing the arena challenges. It's like seven challenges with different requirements. Where you have to get through 15 waves of enemies. Pretty easy, as long as you use uh, the guy that I did. And that's like... I don't know why they made it. Why they make trophies like that sometimes, because it's so easy. Uh... And that one's pretty easy, and Heroes Unlocked at the beginning of the game, but it's pretty annoying, like I said, at a few points in the game. But overall, definitely worth going for. So 2,884 trophies, so a little over 100 away from 3,000. And at the time this is being recorded, I know I'm going to get my PS4 probably in a few weeks or so. So there's the real possibility I could reach 3,000 trophies first. It depends on what my next Gamefly game is, but yeah... Level 28, or excuse me, 2,884 trophies. Level 19, 79%. 45 platinums, 240 gold, 647 silvers, and 1,952 bronzes. 
So guys, that is it for this platinum trophy. And I will change my thing up here, but I hope you guys enjoyed the video. And next time, as I have been saying for the last like two months, the next will either be Dead Rising 2 off the record, Red Dead Redemption, Borderlands 2. Well, actually, no, Borderlands 2 is going to take a lot longer. Yeah, it's not going to be Borderlands 2, but I hope to eventually platinum it. Or whatever I get next on Gamefly. So, I guess that's it. I will see you guys next time.